Yo, what is good, YouTube? It is Tizzy here, man, and today I'm back with another banger. I am bringing you the best sensor build, the best possible sensor build in NBA 2K22 current gen. I just made this build around 12 hours ago when I started my stream, and man, oh man, am I impressed by this build. Uh, I made a I made a really bad inside center build last night, and then I messed around with the player builder after stream, and then I came across this build, and holy shit, this build is insane, man. So let's just get straight into it. First, what you want to do, you want to go into the features, you want to go into the settings. Make sure we do this. This is a must do before we make the build. And then we want to make sure we have the units of measurement in the metric system. We need it to be in the metric system to create this build. And then you want what you want to do, you want to go over to the My Player, launch the builder, make it a power forward. Make it whatever handedness you prefer, whatever jersey number you guys prefer, man. None of this really matters. And then what we want to do, we want to choose the pure red pie chart. The pure red pie chart. We want to make this build pure speed. I know a lot of people would go with the speed and vertical. But for this build right here, you need to go pure speed for it to be fully optimized, man. You want to max out everything here. You want to make the steel a 74. Just like so. Oh no, 72, sorry. Max everything else out. Leave the post hook alone, max everything else out, driving layout, make sure it's a 67. And then we want to max out the pass accuracy, the, and then make sure we go to just like that. And then we can go one more on the steel, 73 steel, just like so. And this is exactly what we're looking for here. And then we want to make sure we're going with the burly. We want to make the height 209. So this height right here, this will bring you to 6, 10 and a half. 6, 10 and a half. That build is huge. This build is insane, man. At 6, 10 and a half with a mass, you get max wingspan as well. You want to make sure we go max wingspan minimum weight. And with a 6, 10 and a half build, with how OP chase downs are this year, they're even better than they were in 2K20 in my opinion. You get, if I played, I only have bronze chase down on this build so far. After 12 hours, I got a lot of other defensive badges, obviously, as well. But I only have bronze chase down on at the moment. And I get every chase down. The animations that you get on a 6-10 build, you fly, man. You don't want to go with all these 6-8 builds. You're going to dog them. You're going to absolutely dog these 6-8 pure reds. Make sure we go minimum weight, max wingspan. And look at that. At 99 overall, you'll get a 99 defensive rebound, 99 offensive rebound, 99 block. 82 interior D, 81 perimeter, perimeter D, 81 lateral quickness. You get an 88 speed and an 87 acceleration. That's damn near a 90 speed on a 6, 10 and a half build. And as well as that, you get a 99 standing dunk. So with this build, you're going to get all the pause and animations. You're going to get the elite big man contact dunks. You're not going to get the other contact dunks, but that doesn't matter. Contact dunks are so rare in this game. But the pauses on this game. From what I've played so far in this 12 hours, you get a lot of pause and animations with the elite contact dunk animations. The elite big man contact dunk, excuse me. But yeah, this build here, man, I'm calling it right now. This is going to be the meta build within a couple of months. Everyone's going to be running the 16 and a half in stage soon. I was messing around with this build. I, I made a really bad big man build last night. And then after stream, I messed around. And then my player build, I, I came across this build. And my, oh my, this build did not disappoint this build is insane man as soon as i made this build i maxed it out to 85 and me and chico damn near went on our biggest streak yet a 50 win streak with no badges this build right here is insane man honestly make this build you will not be disappointed i honestly think it's the best center build in the game right now 6 10 and a half damn near 90 speed 99 rebound 99 block 99 standing dunk this build is insane man put on hall of fame interceptor and hall of fame chase down artist and you'll be flying everywhere around the court man lanes on this build are crazy chase downs are crazy and i mean hey if this has helped you out in any which way if you come to the conclusion that you like this build make sure you leave, leave a like you subscribe you turn on those notification man and i'll see you guys in the next video peace